This is a drainage pipe that I installed last summer and it's designed to pick up whatever ground runoff occurs from this pasture across here. And all that water will travel down right to this corner. And I've dug in um, probably 36 inches deep right here on that side of the log and filled it in with gravel and then started my my pipe right here with a little mesh um, on the end of it, uh, like a one, one inch or half inch by half inch cloth, wire cloth. And you can see that the water is just traveling all across the top of this uh, pasture right here. You can see it flowing. We had 16 inches of snow, which I don't know, that's equivalent to about an inch and a half, I guess, of rain, depending on how you look at it. And so all that water flows right down here and then it seeps. Um, I'm really impressed with how well that this design has turned out because this spot right here that I'm walking on is the rock is even dry. <clears throat> Dig down an inch or so and you can see that it's it gets a little moist. But the pipe is perforated. It's um it's actually 60 foot of pipe and there's about 35 foot of it that's perforated on top. So we, we catch water here, we catch any runoff across here. And this little spot last winter from this log over to that log was nothing but a boggy marsh like you see right there just on the outside of the of the gravel so I've got to come in here and add gravel here and a little bit on this side and we're good so that gives me good access from back over there by the barn across this way and uh, this water flows right down across the little ditch that I dug last summer as well it's not it's not really a deep ditch it's meant just simply to capture this water flow coming across here and give it a place to travel without getting all out into this marshy area here. <coughs> and then I dug in right across here this, basically it's a little pocket pond. Um, and I'd have to do something here to eliminate erosion. But eventually, this will all be f opened up. Uh, maybe in a year or two, this will all be opened up across here as a larger pond system. I'll have a couple of small little pocket ponds uh, up this way. Uh, this will be like a mid-tier pond. And then back over on the other side of that little roadway, there will be another pond. And then a third or fourth pond even further down uh, towards the bottom over that way. So that wraps up this, this little tour right here, uh, just above the pond system. Across here is three swales in series with one another and you can see on that ridge line right at the crest of that ridge line I have roughly 15 trees planted in that swale drop down to swale number two then swale number three and that below swale number three is where the pond system will start
That'll do it for now. Thank you.